Good morning. Breaking news. Massive manhunt. The FBI on a desperate search this morning for an armed and dangerous woman. They say making credible threats said to be infatuated with the Columbine shooting massacre just days before its 20th anniversary. Columbine and dozens of Denver area schools closed today. So who is that woman? What we know in a live report. Out of bounds, newly obtained documents in the Jesse Smollett case revealing the prosecutor who recused herself was still weighing in on the case. The explosive texts and emails just ahead. Lost and found new images of the devastating damage inside Notre Dame Cathedral and what was saved. Plus the questions now dogging investigators. Why did it take 23 minutes just to find the fire? This morning, Craig live from Paris with the rebuilding already underway. All that plus three day threat. The powerful storms bearing down on tens of millions from Texas to Maryland. No confidence why even some pilots may be hesitant to fly those 737 MAX planes and the massive impact to your summer travel plans already. And surprise. While you were sleeping, Beyonce was busy releasing an unannounced album and a Netflix special. And the Beehive is buzzing today, Wednesday, April 17th, 2019. From NBC News, this is Today with Savannah Guthrie and Hoda Kotb, live from Studio 1A in Rockefeller Plaza. Hi, everybody. Good morning. Nice to have you with us on a Wednesday morning. We've got Willie in for Hoda, and now we can tell you why. If you haven't heard the news, Hoda's got a new baby girl at home, Little Hope. I just finally closed my mouth from the surprise <laughs> yesterday on the air. I was so shocked and so happy, and we're so thrilled for Haley and Hope and Hoda and Joel. And you had an audience with Hope yesterday. Yes, we did. Jen and I went right over right after the show. I don't even know if we were invited, but we went in and we saw the baby. She's adorable. Hoda is doing great and is just so so happy and pleased. It's it's really wonderful. So are we. We'll have more on that in a bit, but we want to get to this breaking news, an urgent story. Officials shutting down schools in the Denver area this morning, and there's an ongoing search right now for a woman who flew to Colorado and purchased a gun ahead of the 20th anniversary of the tragedy at Columbine. That's according to federal officials. We've got NBC's Joe Fryer on the story this morning. Joe, good morning to you. Savannah, good morning. More than half a million students in the Denver area won't be going to school today. The call to cancel classes was made overnight, hours after the FBI released more details about a woman who authorities say is extremely dangerous and poses a credible threat.